Hello everyone, welcome to Insights into Your Being. Today, with whatever is going around due to the fear of this virus, I decided to share my bit of knowledge through this video. There are really just two mental patterns that contribute to any disease. One is fear and the other is anger. Anger can show up as impatience, irritation, frustration, criticism, resentment, jealousy or bitterness. These are all thoughts that poison our body. When we release this burden, all the organs in our body begin to function properly. And fear could be tension, anxiety, nervousness, worry, doubt, not feeling good enough or feeling of unworthiness. Do you relate to any of this stuff? We must learn to substitute faith for fear if we are to heal. Faith in what? Faith in life. We have to believe that life loves me and I am safe. We live in a yes universe. No matter what we choose to believe or think, the universe always says yes to us. If we think poverty, the universe says yes to that. If we think prosperity, the universe says yes to that too. So, we want to think and believe that we have the right to be healthy, yes? And that health is natural to us. The universe will support and say yes to this belief. If you believe I am healthy, you will stay healthy. If you find yourself with some sort of disease, become your own investigator and healer. Ask yourself, is it one of the forms of fear or is it one of the forms of anger that has turned itself into a disease? Are you willing to release those thoughts? Are you willing to replace those thoughts with positive affirmations? Loving yourself will also contribute greatly to healing your body because love heals. And so the question is, how do we love ourselves? First of all, and most important, stop all criticism of yourself and others. Accept yourself as you are. Praise yourself as much as you can. Criticism breaks down the inner spirit and praise builds it up. Look into the mirror often and simply say, I love you. I really love you. I accept you just the way you are. You are awesome and everybody loves you. It may be difficult at first, but keep practicing and soon you will mean and feel what you say. Love yourself as much as you can and all of life will mirror this love back to you. Allow me to make an affirmation story for you. Share your problem with me through emails and I shall customize an affirmation story for you that you can read tw twice a day in the morning as soon as you wake up and once before sleeping. Reading out your affirmation story loudly looking into the mirror will bring about the change you are looking for. Do hit the like button if you like the video and share it with people you feel may benefit from it. Subscribe my channel to receive the notifications of my latest videos. Thank you for watching. Love yourself.